she's thrown basketball away. That's something that she likes. She could be three times as far as she is now with it. I think she's obsessed with the chase of Dusty. And I will find that she's called him 20 times in three hours. My parents don't even give him a chance at all. I have no idea what he's done. They just think he's a loser. I don't think he works. She definitely steals money for Dusty. The money that was stolen was more for me because I gave him my check money. This is beyond me. I don't understand why a girl would give her hard-earned money over. No, we should go away. I don't need this. I don't need these kind of people in my life. It's hard enough. I won't stop talking to him. The harder we press to get him away from us, we feel that the harder she's pressing to keep him with her. The relationship is toxic. OK, what's your biggest concern? That she could find herself um, in jail one day or pregnant with a person like this. We have not welcomed Dusty because into our home. Because you haven't given him a chance. What has he done wrong? Well, first of all, when you first told me about Dusty, he had a girlfriend. And you told me he was cheating on his girlfriend for you and to be with you. Which first I, of all, I never once said that, so don't put words in my mouth. I remember it differently, and I remember not feeling good about it. And when he came to the house for the very first time, I was uncomfortable, and I think he was uncomfortable. Because you're, you looked down on him. I, I wasn't happy that he had a girlfriend and that he was over you our house. You didn't even know that at first, Mom. You, you looked down on him like he's some, like, like you're better. You're not any better than him. Okay, but now wait a minute. Are you being fair here? Do you expect someday to have children? Yeah. You, you might have a daughter. Okay, are you going to want to have some influence over who she goes with? I mean, be honest. If you have a valid position and you're right in this, then you're not going to have to spin your answers or try to figure out how to waffle around what I'm asking. You're just going to be honest, and the answers will lead us to whatever conclusion they lead us to. If you had a daughter, are you going to want some say in who she dates? Or are you just going to let whoever pulls up at the curb pull up and say, have a good time? No, I mean, I'm going to care who she dates, but if she really likes him and if I, ca I can't control her whole life. Okay, how old were you when you started to see him? 16. 16? Okay, how old were you when you first had sex with him? How long had you been going with him? I don't know. Yes, you do. Look, if the answers are okay, then you don't have any problem answering them. The only reason you're going to have trouble answering a question is because you know that it is non-credible. So you're wanting to hide something, which tells me clearly that you know it's wrong. Have you had confrontations with Dusty? Uh, like twice. Okay. Uh, once, first time, didn't go over so well. What happened? I just saw him at a basketball game, went up to him. Right away, he was extremely rude to me, extremely disrespectful, which since he has apologized. One of the very last basketball games that um, Dusty came to, he wound up following Chloe to a Walmart where she cashed her check and handed um, him half of her paycheck. So that's why when we saw him again, we thought, oh, he's here for money again. OK, are you giving him money? Occasionally I have. It's not like an everyday thing. Oh, I give Dusty money. That's what I do. I go to work to pay Dusty. No. Have you stolen money from your family? Yes. How much have you stolen? Probably a thousand. Probably a thousand dollars? You haven't stolen three thousand dollars? No. And you didn't steal the ten thousand no. dollars that was missing from the desk in the barn? No. Okay, do you think she did? I definitely think that she did. First of all, the barn is not locked. Who keeps that much money? in a desk, in a barn, and then blames it on me. Well, when it was they... there for an extremely short period of time. I would have just known about this money. Why, what would I possibly you do with that much money? You were on the phone with mom when I explained it to her. He... Did you, were did in you the... take the $10,000? No. And we... you said you'll take a polygraph to prove that. Yes. Because I can arrange that for you, and then that'll be off the table for you. That would be fine. Yes. That would be nice. You, yeah. you would like to know that. Why not? Right. All right. You are stealing money from your family. Why are you doing that? They like to control how much money I get, how they take my checks so I don't have money. Uh -huh. they, I get $200 a month from this trust fund. I haven't seen it in, I don't even know how long. And I can explain that. It went to pay for her car my and her taxes here. and plate, license plates, and I have it all tallied up on a paper. It's legitimate. I'm not using your money for myself. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.